everyone, Gray Power 60 here. And off. Let's get some fluffy hair going. Oh, I still have the su the earrings that Miss Susan Sunshine made me. It was so sweet of her. Oh, the sun is bright. It's cold, but the sun is bright. It was minus seven celsius with a wind chill today but now it's down so sorry you can't see me down to minus two which is what about 28 because zero is 30 degrees zero celsius is 30 degrees fahrenheit so whatever just taking my puppy out for a quick run. I just have to run up to the store. And I am sorry, but I can't put my visor down. Oh. Nobody coming good. Because I gotta put sunglasses on, but I don't wear them, so they're all full of um dust. <laughs> rarely wear sunglasses but anyway yeah so I hope you enjoyed my DIY videos yesterday with my glowing Easter eggs I'm bringing them over to my my grandsons tomorrow we're gonna have a day of it I might go live with my grandson in the afternoon uh, gotta be there for 11 11 30 11 o'clock probably so um, I gotta go online and find some more games or I've got to come up with some other games for the kids to play um, we like to do all kinds of crazy things so I'll have to come up with a couple of games that's good for the older fellas, but inclusive of the three-year-old because he definitely likes to do what his big brothers do, which is hilarious. Sometimes it's hilarious. It's been a beautiful sunny day. It's supposed to be nice and sunny for the next week. So how y'all doing? I haven't been doing as many videos. Mom and I have been kind of busy. We've been doing stuff and blah, 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 blah. Okay, I'm going to be going into the little store for a bit. I'm going to pick up a ticket for Mom. And a few things for me. Brought my puppy along for the ride. He's got a vet appointment next week, so we'll see how that goes. So I'll be back in a flash. Time is at 6 o'clock, 6 p.m., and it's Saturday. Oh, I need some more, what do they call wings. I like lots of wings and hair all over. Last time I saw Jane Fonda, I wish I looked like her. Oh my God. Um, the way she wears her hair wispy, I love that. But of course, I don't have a high forehead. I got a short forehead. So a lot of these, and my hair is thick. So I don't have all of the, the advantages. I find a lot of people a lot of hairstyles that I really, really like. Um, most of their hair is fine. It's not coarse and thick, which mine is coarse and thick, so naturally I don't get a lot of that really cute wispiness. C cute wispiness. What can I say? to buy a condo 
buy a condo, buy an RV, and go visit all you guys, and just live in it, and just travel, and, you know, I've looked at tiny homes, and RVs, and to be honest with you, I think I would like to have, there's a trailer, uh, a trailer that you pull, you'd have to pull with a truck, there's a trailer called Lance, and it has everything I want. If I'm not mistaken, I've looked at so many. The Lance has a back um, kitchen with a stove and an oven and a microwave and a sink, blah, 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 blah. But it's also got a shower and the shower, a bath, bathroom with the shower. But the shower actually is like not a tub, but it's quite deep so that, you know, if I wanted to put a waterproof little chair in there or something. and I mean, you know, I'm just, but the layout for me was perfect, you know. However, I don't want to pull a trailer. So my only other option, to me, the only other option would be is to buy a C-Class, which I really like because I like to be able to drive it like a truck. I don't want it long. I don't want it big. Um, you know, 19, 20 feet is fine with me. And that way, if I wanted to, I could tow a little car, you know, a little Austin Mini or something, you know, or Volkswagen, the old ones, you know. I'm just going to the Dollar Tree. But I've been looking at everything, and I'm definitely into composting toilet. I mean, what a thing to talk about, but guys, that's what that's what my dream is. That's what my dream is. Thank you. Uh, a van is too small, although it's perfect for driving for me. A van would be perfect. Um, just not enough space. I'm not outdoorsy enough. And I'm an old lady. And this old lady needs the comforts of home. It's closed? What? Today's not Sunday, it's Saturday. It should be open. It should be open late. Okay, well, we're just going to have to try and park over here. Look, look, look. How are these? Oops, take the thing off. Oh, I kind of like these. I look like a mess. I kind of like these glasses. They're kind of cool. Those ones are more for reading. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go home. I told Mama I was only going to go to the store, pick up her ticket and cigarettes. And I ended up coming to the dollar store. And oh, blew the wad. No, I didn't blow the wad, but I certainly spent more than I should have. So we're home, and uh, we will Talk to you later. Where did I fill my wallet? Oh, here it is. I gotta put my phone in my wallet. So thanks for joining me on my little ride. And uh, if I don't get a chance to um, do anything else, uh, I will see you next time. Thanks for joining me. And bye for now. Alrighty, let's show you what I got at the dollar store. Um, I already showed, and I spent what? It's a dollar twenty-five in Canada. 
So it cost me $23.75. HST, $3. So it was $26. $26. Got my lottery ticket I was telling you about. So the practical things is I bought a couple of these containers with the lids. I bought square or rectangle and I bought um, round ones. And I thought sometimes when mom and I go to the bingo, it's expensive to eat there. So I could put a little snack in there for us and bring our own lunch. Since we've already got the food, why buy more? So, you know, sometimes we end up spending an extra $10, $15 to eat. So, I thought that was. So, the other practical thing, you saw the glasses. You saw the glasses. I like them. I would have preferred them if they were purple, but I kind of like them. You get out of there, young man. My dog is smelling the... Uh... Anyway. Those are my spare. I always like to have an extra spare just in case. And usually I hang them on the uh, lampshade. So I got a couple on there. Some of them are old. Okay, um, the other kind of practical thing I got was a stylus. Um, I have my tablet my tablet here and I play games on it and I get tired of using my finger so sometimes I want to use a, a stylus I had one and you know I'll probably find it now that I bought this one I'll probably find it but I thought it was pretty and it's supposed to be a flashlight a little red light that I can play with the cats. A stylus. What was the other thing it said on there? <laughs> ah, grab the box. It said, oh, and twist to use the pen. Okay, so a pen, a stylus, a flashlight, and a laser. So twist. Oh, and look, it comes right out the end of the stylus, the pen. Play stuff. Okay. Okay, so um, I saw this bubble set, and it's supposed to be able to stay on your hand. So that would be great fun for the boys. And then, of course, I got them each one, because we're playing tomorrow. I got them each one. We may or may not use them. We may just use this. It might be more fun. So that's, so a little craft. I picked up this. I know it's just junky. I'm going to bring some extra stuff, um, but you can make your own little wacky wool craft pals. So there's a spider, there's a puppy dog, and there's a funny monster. And it comes with everything. So it's got a styrofoam ball, it's got the wool, and all of the little pom-poms and pipe cleaner, etc. in that. I a lot of room on this tape. So I was showing you this. Um, I really, really liked it. And I thought it would be pretty to put on pocket letter or to make some of those, um, not flip books, but kind of the, the photo, not the photo album, but the little, you know, keepsake album where you can put photos and stuff. And I thought these were nice, you know, sore today, strong tomorrow. Uh, you are capable of amazing things. Start the day with a smile and end it with champagne. Oh, the other practical thing that I bought are these fashion pens. I love these pens. Sometimes um, when I was working, I would bring um, a couple of these pretty pens and give them to the girls because sometimes we needed pens when we were working. So I've got these three pretty pens. I'm going to make sure they're working. Throw them in my bingo bag so that the next time I go, I'll be able to share them with one of the girls. One at a time, you know. I just like doing that. And so that you've seen that. And that. So the rest is all 
junk. These are gummy bunnies. And I thought maybe we would do a taste test. My grandsons love doing that. These are cookies and cream eggs. Probably the white chocolate stuff. I know my grandson, we tried this before, uh, the barbecue peanuts, the planters ones. I know my grandsons don't like it, but I'll leave it at home because mom might like to munch on those. Then I picked up peanut butter cups by Palmer's. And these are kind of in with the Easter stuff. So that'll be another thing to try. Although they prefer trying um, sour stuff. And then I bought three packages of the mixes. I've got the O. Henry, the Hershey, and the Reese's. And what I like to do is I put them all in a bowl and eat them like that. Oh, one more thing. And I bought Easter egg bubble gum because I know my uh, son's son, grandson, loves bubble gum. That's it. That's it. That's what I bought. That's what I bought. That's what I got. Hi, Mom. I'm just doing my video. Did you eat anything? Nothing yet. <laughs> it's time to after seven. Uh oh, we haven't had supper. I gotta go. I I'll talk to you later. Bye for now.